Speaking with Moose Jaw Warriors head coach Mark O'Leary ahead of uh, tonight's uh, second game of the regular season against the Brandon Wheat Kings. Uh, let's talk about last night first. Uh, 4 nothing loss in Prince Albert to kick off the season. A game where it was pretty tight through 40 minutes and then just kind of first five minutes of that third period a game got away from you guys a little bit. Yeah, there was uh, a whole lot to be pleased with to be honest. I thought uh, our details and our structure without the puck was was pretty good. Uh, we didn't give them a whole lot until uh, you know, that tough stretch in the third period, but I'm impressed with our, you know, especially our younger guys picking it up pretty quick in terms of our, you know, our D zone structure and, you know, things through the neutral zone and our four check gave us a chance. It seemed, uh, you mentioned the young guys, it seemed like they took another step from the preseason to, to that first regular season game. Yeah, absolutely they did. They weren't, uh, you know, they weren't overwhelmed with the moment. You know, I thought they uh, generated some good looks, uh, some good ozone time, and that's what you're looking for from those, uh, from those guys. Just create a little bit of momentum. Um, you know, I think that uh, as you move up our lineup, that's where we're looking for a little bit more. Um, you know, obviously we need to generate some offense, and I thought we had some pretty good looks, but you know, just being a little bit more prepared inside and being ready when the opportunity is there. Defensively, it seemed like uh, they were able to get some odd man rushes and some breaks that, that kind of hurt you guys as the game went on. Yeah, I think if there's one thing we can clean up, it's our tracking details. Um, you know, I thought as the game as the game wore on, you know, whether we started to press a little bit the other way, trying to take a little bit more chances. But, you know, there's some details there coming back into our zone that we can clean up just a little bit and hopefully create some offense going the other way. What's the key against Brandon tonight? Uh, they come off a, an OT loss against Regina last night. Well, I think the tracking that we just talked about is going to be real important. Brandon, uh, fast transition, their D will be jumping, and you know those details that we talk about coming back into our zone are going to be real important. And um, you know, again, I thought uh, looking back to the preseason game against them, uh, five on five, you know, we were the better team, and you know they uh, took advantage of special teams, so that'll be big as well tonight. Well, good luck here tonight. Thank you.